Stanford University. When you look at places like San Francisco Bay Area, Los Angeles, San Diego, these cities couldn't exist without the massive infrastructure that we have in place to move water around. We're at the limit of the capacity of those systems to supply our water needs uh, during the time of drought and in the future with population increase and with uh, climate change. Stormwater is something that we haven't really utilized fully. And now we look at stormwater in a new, in a new light, um, not something just to be put into the ocean as quick as you can, but rather as a way to augment our urban water supplies. In, in Sonoma County, we're looking at ways in which we could uh, capture and treat that stormwater to remove contaminants. Um, there's also an interest in removing nutrients, nitrogen and phosphorus from the stormwater. In Los Angeles, we're working with the city to help design a system that would convert a former rock quarry into a stormwater capture and treatment and recharge system. This is a large site, about 50 acres, currently a dump. This dump would become something that looks like a park, but this park-like setting really serves an important purpose, and that's to capture a lot of stormwater. In that area, you're adjacent to the Los Angeles River, where the ground is very permeable, so there's a good place to put that water. The question is, is how can we do that in a way that we can be sure that we're not contaminating groundwater? Stormwater capture and use will help solve the problem of beach pollution. And in the wintertime, when you have heavy storms, the beaches get contaminated by all this uncontrolled uh, stormwater that rushes down into places like Santa Monica Bay. A properly designed facility, one that looks more like a park, provides community amenities. So in the end, stormwater provides an opportunity to augment water supply. If we do that properly, it will solve problems with coastal pollution and it can help provide a better urban aesthetic as well.